Alright. I know y'all been waiting for one of these videos. It's a lot of y'all that have been waiting. Joe. Got trials. Got my grandma. Y'all know I've been doing my whole, you know, following the trend, you know, going around trying this shit that I've never tried before. I'm making Kent's Bumbleclot American Jerk Chicken and Rice and Peas. Let me say this. I've never done this. I am not of this, you know, background. So this is just me just approximating and taking do some guesswork. I didn't even look at no recipes. I'm like, yo, boom, boom, and here we go. So we got our pot shots to Pat. You know, Pat gave this to me for my birthday. Pat, also for the merch. So this is how I season the chicken. I had thawed these out last night also. So I'm gonna add a little pepper. Get some of this chicken seasoning in there. Some smoked paprika. Shouts to Deshaun. Then we're gonna put some wrap up flakes. Like I said, I'm freestyling this. I don't know. And last but not least, jerk seasoning. I'm glad that he asked for me to make this because for the place that I got the jerk chicken at, it closed down. I told you that? Screw my phones. So how I seasoned it is how I tasted it. We're gonna start talking about using a little bit of avocado oil. Like I said, I don't know what I'm doing. We're gonna figure this shit out though. We're using chicken thighs. Boneless chicken thighs. Well, you in Jamaica now. So we're gonna let this cook up for a little bit. I'm gonna, I'm gonna cook them for like two minutes on both sides, and then I'm gonna throw them in the oven to cook for the rest. I got my oven already preset at 385. Right, so I'm gonna have it cooking in for like 10 minutes. I'm gonna put a little bit of this barbecue sauce. Basically, it's a Basco drip barbecue sauce. Jamaican, I'm sorry, I apologize. I'm St. Lucia, but my dad said I'm not even that. He said I'm American. All right, so I'm gonna wash my rice. Wash your goddamn rice. So we wash that rice, we're about to start boiling our water, right? Now I did watch Allison do this before, but I know it got some of this shit that's on this. I haven't got what we wanted to eat. Put the kidney beans in there, then I'm gonna put some coconut milk, and then we're gonna put the rice in last with the, with the green onions, a serrano. We're gonna leave this for, we're gonna, we're gonna do something else. And then we're gonna put this bad boy, right? I couldn't get the, I couldn't get the pimento balls, balls. But we got we got we got like a little blend version. So let's get this in. And yes, I know these are croaker beans. What I have at the base is three cups, and I'm just gonna put the fourth cup coconut. My mom is New York black. Ain't that right, mama? She's from the Bronx, so God bless her. She can cook. But she ain't me! I'm gonna salt this a little bit as well. I'm gonna do two sprinkles. Just in case. Then we're gonna throw it in. It's boiling now. We're gonna throw in our cup in the middle. We're gonna add our rice in. Now, this is two cups of um, white rice. I'm just let this cook down. Okay, so as y'all can see, we are done. The last thing I did do though was make like a little jerk gravy, which was just simple. I just did a little bit of the um the mild jerk paste. I put some brown sugar. A little bit of a little squirt of honey and some vegetable stock and then I did a cornstarch slurry in them. That was all I did. Oh and I added a little bit of smoked paprika. Because we all know that paprika's not a fucking season. Alright, and then I also added a little bit of brown sauce because I wanted it to be dark. So I'm gonna try it. I haven't tried it yet. It's not bad. It's not bad, but it's definitely not my best thing I've ever made, I'm gonna be honest. So let's try this chicken. Hey man. I think I I think I made it exactly like this video. Hold up. I got a little spice to it too, bruh. It's just like it. 
because I, I know I remember like it had like a sweetness, but then in the back end it was like a spiciness. The rice, full. Honestly, let's see what the let's see if the jerk sauce saves it. With the jerk gravy I did, brings up like six. But the chicken, to me, I nine. Eight point seven to nine. I ain't give it a 10 out of 10, but all the I feel like it is. But it's really up to you to say. The rhymes? I like a five. A five. Yeah. That's me. Chicken good. I ain't got nothing to compare it to, but I can give you an eight. Like a, a 8.5. I'll take it. Like I said, I ain't never had jerk chicken. It's my first time. Like, you know, I ain't cultured. Listen, I think I have done myself. And yes, I'm going to sleep like this. But, guys, that's enough for this video. Catch you guys on the next one. If you guys have any recommendations while we got the time to do this, let me know. That I got like that spice in the back end. I did it. Hey, olive flavor. I know y'all closed. If y'all need a new chef. That don't, that don't even make sense. I'm taking over. Hey, if y'all got a street fighter, play me.